Hello guys, today is 21st of June 2022. Right, this is for my kind of hobby project, which took me years to get to actually doing it. Um, as you can see, I'm not <laughs> super ready, but I was playing with this one for now. It's kind of in the first stages of prototype, and it's finally kind of starting to get the basic forms. Right, uh, the so the idea is to build like a four-wheel bicycle. I'm not sure what you're seeing there. I'm not sure I can move the camera while filming, but yeah. So, anyways, it's kind of going to be like a quick test. So. As you can see, I've attached the seats to the to the metal bars. Like, hopefully you can see that. Uh, there, there is still no like rigidity bars between the the main kind of kind of metal connections. But I just want to see if, test if it can take like my weight. So here we go. Uh, let me do the crazy shit. So. I'm essentially standing on one of the seats. Ooh, shit. Right, I hope you've seen me doing that. Right. And as you can see, the seat is, hopefully can see, the seat is actually connected only to two metal bars going through. There's actually four. So it's going to be like some rigidity bars between them so just to make sure that the weight is distributed more between those four bars they're also going to be connected by the between the two of them because there's going to be back wheels attached between the bars so <laughs> but this is the stage i got through to until now it took me years most of the time it was taking me like just to get through shit and anyways you know, so I'm finally kind of in a productive stage where I'm actually doing things. Hey, right? I've been talking about this project to to my friends for a while now. Uh, I my, my, bet many of them were like, "Hell, he's just talking." That will never happen. Well, it's happening. It's getting there. Right? It's depending on because my strength my hands are not the straightest when it comes to mechanical engineering so another bit of advice for me when, when it goes into like actually being made in a proper thing <laughs> it needs to be done by somebody with straight hands because uh, i don't know uh, you probably can't see it but yeah the back the back seat is actually attached a bit crooked <laughs> So it's not it's not connecting straight. <laughs> I drilled the, the 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 holes a bit wrong way when I was doing this. So okay, shit happens. So I'm gonna have to drill a bit more holes and try and make it straight. But now that it's actually already being kind of connected up, I'll be able to do that a bit better. Fingers crossed. Right, but it's in stages. So yeah. It takes my weight. Let's try the front seat. Okay. Hopefully that shit I'm gonna break. I think the seat is about to be breaking. The seats have been taken from an old BMW since I'm in Germany, right? You know. I mean I'd like to have taken them out of a Porsche, but I think those are a bit expensive. But okay, so yeah, it takes my weight, but for now I think a good idea would be not put anything above 200 kilograms on one of those or it will break right i'm 150 so it takes it once the rigidity bars will be there it should distribute the weight more evenly between four bars so you'll be able to take bigger weights right so there's a bit more stuff to be done quite a bit more stuff to be done but this is the base once the base is kind of there i think Things are gonna start working out a bit easier. Again, fingers crossed. So, if you watch this, thank you. If you want to build a four-wheel push bike, all the best to you. I think you know it's a great idea, especially for somebody who does not want to buy a car. 
and hopefully in the next five six years you will see more videos of this one becoming something which is actually writable so thank you very much goodbye yo